Hey everyone, so we have so many exciting things to talk about today from a new trading platform to more Shiba Inu news. I'm really excited to talk about this because crypto is adapting and so are the bigger platforms right now. So be sure to drop a like to see what happens next. Now, there are some huge rewards and there's a lot of money to make in the cryptocurrency space. One of them is SHIB. Yes, while the price might be down, you know, a lot of traders, a lot of crypto investors are still making massive amounts of money. And we can see 145,000 a per year. And obviously I think this is a bug or, or some sort. It only increases that for about a few minutes because people are selling their Ethereum. It's not actually much earnings for most of us. I had 1 million staked and you did, don't get that much Ethereum, but you get it a lot. So you can see if you bury over here, you're supposed to get a lot, but it's, it's just a bug, you know? Everyone who saw this, you should be aware of that. But let's talk about this and this is Bybit, you know, one of the best things out there, you get a $600 bonus. Um, this is not sponsored, but if we check over here, the most beautiful thing they have right now is they opened a new spot. Now, if we check over here, they have Bitcoin and Ethereum, and hopefully they, you can buy crypto in the future, such as Shiba Inu. You, they have markets, they have everything, and that's simply perfect to me. Right now, the users enjoy a 10% discount for all trading pairs during the marathon period. So there's a special period right Right now, which is really, really important, where they offer you huge bonuses. They're trying to get more people in because I think it's a great platform. I've been using it myself. Honestly, I'm not logged in right now, but uh, you can see over here, you can simply trade Bitcoin and Ethereum on the spot. You can buy low, sell high. If you're a trader, be sure to check that out. But going back to SHIB news, I'm really excited, excited to what comes next with Bybit. I do think it can become one of those bigger platforms in the future. It's already huge and a lot of people are using it. And if we check over here, quarter to quarterly cryptocurrency report, and they do mention Shiba Inu. So before moving on, we're happy to announce that we just released new books and under how to DeFi series. The beginner version is an up updated version of our previous DeFi book, while the more advanced version is more depth into DeFi, so do check them out. And I also wanted to mention, when talking about Bybit, they're having a $600 bonus, and the link is in the description if you want to check that out. Thank you so much for clicking on that, because you get a bonus, you know, I personally get a bonus, which is really exciting, but we check over here that cryptocurrency is still growing in its own way. Dogecoin flew to the moon as it gained 366% and outperformed the top five cryptocurrencies. Bitcoin ended quarter to 2021 at 35,000 or 36,000, a 44% decline from its all-time high. BCC and Polygon are leading the DeFi expansion beyond Ethereum. Despite not being in the top five cryptocurrency, SHIB outperformed Doge. So SHIB is now outperforming Doge. Hopefully, you know, every single platform notices such as Bybit and they actually do list Doge as that would increase the volume. I would be really excited for that and I fully support, you know, wherever Doge goes. And we also love Doge by itself. We, we support where SHIB goes, but SHIB is outperforming Doge as it ended the quarter with a huge return, you know? So it made people billionaires and gaming NFTs saw renewed interest. All true floor prices have also dropped, but uh, more people are becoming interested in gaming NFTs. And what we saw is Axie Infinity growing. Corresponding to volume increase, Axie Infinity saw its revenue grow 118x. So uh, they're getting more fees or they're having bigger fees than Ethereum and Bitcoin. And that's simply crazy to me. You know, um, obviously there is a, a big market in video games. And I think for some people, they will be spending thousands if Shiba Inu gets its own video game. For example, growing your own ship. For example, growing up your own docs. That is an idea I have, you know, for a developer out there because they can seriously profit with partnering up with a Shiba Inu franchise or Shiba Inu brand. Because in two years, maybe three years, there's going to be developers working with Shiba Inu and maybe, you know, Shiba Inu will seriously push it out. And by then, we're going to be seeing that massive growth. So obviously that takes a lot of time. It takes a lot of money. So we could be seeing that in a year. But if this happens, imagine what will happen to Shiba Inu's price if you had to actually use the Shiba Inu coins and they, they would burn. They would just burn when you would grow your own pet. I would find that really exciting. There's so many possibilities for Shiba Inu to grow. Even
even when it's dipping, even when it's increasing, Shiba Inu is staying strong. But spot exchange volume had its monthly high at in May at 3.5 trillion. So there's a huge market for spots right now before it dropped 60% in June 2021. So it's still huge, you know, still a lot of people do everything. But we can see Dogecoin flew to the moon as it gained 366% and outperformed the top five cryptocurrencies. I think this tells you that Shiba Inu has a strong potential. You know, there's still a lot of things going on, but inquire to the market enter into the meme frenzy. Dogecoin led the pack with an impressive 366% gain. Meanwhile, Bitcoin suffered a loss of 40%. Overall, top five cryptocurrencies underperformed from previous quarter. Bitcoin ended quarter two 2021 at 35 or 36,000, a 44% decline from its all-time high. So, you know, Bitcoin not at its best moment right now, but uh, after Elon Musk tweeted, after Coinbase, uh, Coinbase direct listing, you know, it just dropped. And we can see that El Salvador is trying to make Bitcoin a legal tender. It gave it a slight bump, but then it crashed again. You know, some of the whales already sold. So if you check over here, we can see that. We also have a lot more news to go on about. But this is just, you know, a basic example. We saw such big increases. But in the quarter two of 2021, we're not seeing those big increases just yet. We need to see Bitcoin go back if we want Shiba Inu to actually grow. So we saw this in January 2021. We saw, you know, 30,000 and we're back at 35,000, 30,000 or so. So we need to see these increases again, you know, that we saw in April, that we saw in May. I want to see that. I want to see the at its highest, 64,000. That's simply crazy to me. But look at how much the whales have sold in that time period, you know, so people have sold at big profits. Obviously, when a big spikes happen, you can see downtrends over here, you know, happening for a few months. Uh, but once again, what happened in January to February is they were getting like this downtrend, such as we're seeing over here. But now we're seeing a positive uptrend once again. And I think this will in the future increase even more. It obviously won't just skyrocket like to the, to oblivion. But what will happen here is we're going to be seeing that slow growth as whales are now buying Bitcoin. They're buying in ship. Um, yes, the prices are dropping because other whales are selling, but the whales are still in and they're keeping it silent because they want to get Bitcoin and all other coins at very cheap prices. So I definitely do think this won't prove in the future. Now, there's another reason, like remember that Bitcoin's price was once five cents and I don't think Shiba Inu will ever go to five cents, but I think it could go to, you know, one, 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 one tenth of a cent that would still be a big increase half of a cent would be like half of a cent would actually make millionaires so crypto experts say bitcoin replacing fiat money in 20 years and that's really interesting you know because a lot of people have said that bitcoin is not going to be going anywhere not replacing fiat like michael Saylor said that but in a new survey a number of cryptocurrency and fintech professionals expected a hyper bitcoinization to take place by 2040 imagine you know if you were alive by 2040 you would basically be rich by just holding a percentage of bitcoin because if this truly happened the most important thing we have to know is how will Bitcoin be used? I think it will be used as gold and it has a huge potential to outpace gold. It has a huge potential to replace gold. Um, obviously, you know, gold has, is in treasuries, it's in banks and so on. But Bitcoin has the community. Bitcoin has the whales. Bitcoin has the billionaires. And Finder says the report is based on a panel of 42, 42 cryptocurrency experts. It shows that Bitcoin's price crash from April all-time high didn't impact the long-term perspective of crypto professionals. So long-term Bitcoin is still good while the short-term dip is still here. Same goes for Shiba Inu, you know. Even if we're seeing the dip, we're still seeing the updates. The survey reveals that 50% of respondents expect to see Bitcoin overtake global financials, also known as hyper Bitcoinization, within the next 20 years. One third of participants believe the event will occur before 2035. So one third actually thinking, you know, we're going to be seeing some big Bitcoin changes. So by the time I'm going to be, you know, much older, hopefully I'll be still talking about Shiba Inu in the future, while 44% predict that Bitcoin will never be as dominant as form of global finance so if 50 percent of crypto experts so that's about 20 think that bitcoin could overtake global finance that would be simply crazy but bitcoin still is on a very bullish run in the long term so what exactly is the long term some people say long term is 15 years some say long term is two years Right now, in short term, yes, we're seeing the dips, maybe even midterm, but in the long run, maybe by the end of 2021, we're going to be seeing that massive sp spike again. So 33% of crypto experts expect the original cryptocurrency to become the most common 
platform of money in developing countries within the next 10 years. And yes, we saw that with El Salvador, you know, nobody believed this, but another 21% believe that we will see the adoption, but it will take 10 years or more. So one thing panelists agree upon is environmental concerns surrounding Bitcoin mining. A whopping 93% expects the green energy debate will continue to hurt Bitcoin, with 31% believing that energy consumption will significantly impact the price. Yet, more than half of the experts don't think moving to an environmentally friendly proof-of-stake model is the answer despite the potential price repercussion. A 60%, 66% of respondents called the proof-of-work model a necessary evil. And we saw an exclusive interview that Bitcoin has a good chance of becoming the world's reserve currency, but it will take at least 10 years. So taking that 10 years and becoming a reserve currency, that's something we can wait. You know, Shiba Inu will most likely have another explosion in three to five years, maybe even sooner. It all depends on the Shiba Inu's updates. But in three years, in five years, a lot of development could be done. And usually Bitcoins explode in that three to five year development. So for some people, this is long term investment. And in five years, they're going to be doubling their money just from staking. That's the beautiful thing. The the other part is that a lot of people are simply in very early. They bought uh, their coins at a current rate, you know, they bought in the dip. And when the spike happens in two years, that's when, you know, that 10x happens. That's when they can buy a new house. Obviously, you know, people, different people have different goals, but some put in 350000 and get $90,000 back. And that's simply crazy to me because no bank offers that type of return. You know, no job offers that type of return or no 401k. And people are retiring off Shiba Inu staking. That's simply crazy to me, but it is happening. And that's what we need to see for Shiba Inu. Constant update which will bring new buyers and investors, maybe even seniors. So for example, people uh, putting their money instead of a pension fund, they're putting it to crypto because it is growing every single year. Now, Bitcoin is mainly valuable for avoiding censorship, while in Western world, Bitcoin is attractive as a hedge against central banks money printing. So that is something I, I already talked about. But the most important thing we have to note here is that Shiba Inu is not going anywhere from my honest perspective, especially as people are staking now, they're getting their small, but they're still getting constant rewards. You know, this is the same thing that we saw with, for example, SafeMoon when people had a 5% uh, increase to every time someone sent a transaction. So same is happening for SHIB, but in SHIB it's more safe. Now, the most important thing is when you send a transaction in SafeMoon, you get a 5% tax burn. And this is what killed a lot of coins because people simply didn't like, you know, when they sent, for example, $100,000, they got a 5%, so $5,000 taxed, you know, and a lot of people don't agree with that. A lot of people don't like to be immediately be taxed and still get the profits. Basically, you just have to be in early. But we can see over here that for Shiba Inu, you're just getting passive income without even doing anything. You're just getting it like that. You don't have to do anything. You can just sit over here, there. And it sounds like a Ponzi scheme, but it's not because they earn from the fees and they give it back to users. They get paid, you know, as long as people use Shiba Swap and as long as they use their fees, we're gonna be getting those rewards. We're gonna be getting Wolf, you know, people are gonna be staking their tokens, they're gonna be locking them. And in long term, we're finally gonna be seeing that increase. Thank you so much for watching until next time. And I really appreciate you watching this video. Either if you're 50, if you're 60 or if you're 90, it's never too late to be in crypto space. Thank you so much. And I really appreciate all of you.